What'd you call me? I called you a nut. You mother... What is going on guys? God's Regret here. We have some big news out of 343 today. They have just released an update for the Master Chief Collection that will allow us to spawn in kill barriers that only affect certain teams. Let's hop into Forge and show you how it works. All right, so as you can see here, me and Compact Kitty, we just loaded into my Sword Tournament map. We're going to be showing you how these new kill barriers work. So when you spawn the actual barrier in, it's going to look the exact same. Even under the settings, everything is still here just the way that it used to be. The main difference now is the team you set the kill barrier to is the team it will not affect. Meaning this kill barrier is set to red team, so if Kitty and I walk through in a custom game, it would actually not kill us. But any other team that stepped foot inside the barrier would die. Safe havens, same thing. We have one actually over here. Whatever team you set it to is the team it will protect. But let's hop into a custom game and show you exactly how these are going to work. We have a dodgeball court set up with some soft kill barriers just over the line and hard kill barriers towards the back. Let's do it. All right, so now we are in game. What's up, Kitty? What's up, Ned? What'd you, what'd you call me? I called you a Ned. You mother... See, now that's just rude. All right, so as you can see here, the kill barriers on my side are not affecting me whatsoever, but as soon as I cross over to Kitty's side, I start getting the countdown, and if she comes on my side, she will be instantly destroyed. I personally can't wait to see what the Forge community comes up with now that we have a new update to the kill barriers. There's going to be a lot of creative ideas, I'm sure of it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and remember, it's all about the style points. Oh my god! I stuck myself in the face. Thanks for watching God's Regret. It's all about the style point.